My name is Chichi Maponya. I'm the CEO of Maponya Group, but I'm also chairman of Brand South Africa. So uh, the Mara Mentor uh, program is relevant to me on both platforms. Uh, what I do on a day-to-day -day basis is I run the family business. I'm uh, through and through an entrepreneur from an entrepreneurial family. Both my parents were pioneering uh, in terms of entrepreneurship. And I've really been fortunate to have learned from them, to have been mentored by them. And I'm looking forward to being part of this program. Uh, you know, I think the importance of uh, having role models and uh, people that you can tap into uh, for advice, for guidance, uh, to check if you're on the right tra track, um, and a broader, you know, bouncing board, somebody whom you can bounce off your ideas and say, I'm thinking of doing this, uh, do you think it's correct? Or oh, I'm stuck here, I don't know how to handle this uh, a situation. Can you guide me? Or, you know, you've been there, you've done it, uh, perhaps you have a different perspective. I, I think it's uh, very important that uh, we are accessible to other people who are also on the journey of being entrepreneurs. Oh, I think the timing is just so perfect. You know, this is the time really to unearth the talent that we have of entrepreneurs uh, who will really begin to take their mark uh, in the uh, economic stage of the country uh, and, and show themselves uh, in terms of their capabilities, their skills, their innovation. Uh, I think this phase really is that phase of uh, encouraging more and more people to be entrepreneurial. Entrepreneurial is not only running your own business. You can be entrepreneurial being employed. And that means you are innovative in the way that you think and the way that you do things. Uh, you don't only look at process and box. You think outside the box and you are more uh, effective uh, even as an employee. But uh, if you are going to be running your own business as an entrepreneur, uh, then you are contributing directly into the economy by employing people, uh, by making sure that uh, the other service providers that you support are also entrepreneurial in their nature. So you're increasing and circulating a rand within a certain circle of entrepreneurs before it goes out. And, and I think for me that is very significant in terms of the impact that it will have uh, in terms of uh, poverty alleviation, reducing the inequality gap, and making sure that uh, a broader, broader spectrum of people are part of uh, the economy. Lift as you rise. <laughs> that my mother, you know, is a motto that she lived by. Um, through the challenges and difficulties of being an entrepreneur. And, and many of them are similar, you know, uh, whether it's cash flow management, access to markets, uh, uh, a growing product diversity, you know, they, they could be varied, which are specific to the kind of uh, business that you, that you have. But uh, I think two things that really I picked up from my mother, which the one that lift as you rise is a motto that she lived by that as I grow, how many others am I growing? Uh, and then the other thing is uh, making a difference in the communities that uh, you get involved in. Yes, uh, being entrepreneurial and running a business, it's about the rents and cents. You want to be profitable, you want to be sustainable. But I think uh, a, a bigger call really is uh, what difference are you making in people's lives? Uh, the lessons uh, really uh, from, that you take away from anybody who has been before you is uh, not to make the same mistakes that they make um, because those experiences that they have are experiences that they share with you so that you don't have to, you, they shorten your journey uh, to success basically. Uh, you know, and they are giving you that access uh, and uh, I think uh, willingness and openness uh, to learn and engage 
uh, is uh, one of the best assets that any entrepreneur should open themselves up to.